Hey everyone, it's Carlos here. Welcome and welcome back to my channel. Why did I do all that? I don't know. Anyways, you guys, so in today's video, we're going to be doing a mega massive Ulta haul unboxing of goodies that I picked up during a huge sale they actually had it going on where you picked up a couple items here. You got a couple items free here and then I used some points here. Yeah, it was pretty good deals. Anyways, you guys, so if you want to know exactly what goodies I have in here, and in here, you gotta keep on watching. But before you get started on that, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Also hit the notification bell as well. So anytime I upload a new video, you know what happens? You get the notifications. Mm -hmm. And give my video a thumbs up as well because as always, I greatly appreciate it when you guys do that. So let's go ahead and get started to see exactly what goodies I have in here, why I picked them up, what goodies I got for free, and what my overall cost was. So if you're nosy like me, then keep on watching. Well, that didn't sound polite. If you're curious like me, not nosy. Anyways, you guys, let's get started. All right, you guys, so let's go ahead and just get the ball rolling here because we got a bunch of goodies that we need to go through and I definitely do not want to make this video two hours long. All right, you guys, so let's go ahead and get this first small box open and then I'll explain the reason why I picked up the items. I won't go into overall price points um, just because I don't remember. So let's go ahead and take out the first item that I picked up. Oh, I do remember the price on these. So I end up picking, <laughs> I end up picking these particular, um, I guess, hair, um, I'm, they're not called, oh yeah, they are called bobby pins. So I end up picking these uh, bobby pins up, hopefully, the sun, their sun, <laughs> the lighting is kicking back. Anyway, so I end up picking these bobby pins up. I'm hoping my daughter will actually use these. So fingers crossed, she's three, well, she'll be three, She'll be three in like another week or so. Oh my goodness. Anyways, you guys, so I ended up picking these up for her. Um, this did retail for $10. Now, the reason why I ended up picking these up, and I'm hoping that the lighting isn't really kicking back too much where you can't get, a, where you can get an actual visual of what they look like. Talk, Carl's talk. Anyways, so the reason why I picked up because her, <laughs> her first name is Nova. You see where I stuttered, right? Like I don't even know my own daughter's name. Anyways, special. So first name is Nova. Her middle name is Luna. So it's basically, if you translate it into English, is new moon. So Nova Luna. So right here, there is the moon and then there's a star. So, and you know, Nova also has like the star representation of the name. Hopefully that makes sense. Oh, so okay i'm not sure if you guys are familiar with this let me put this to the side damn that's huge anyways you guys so i'm not sure if you're familiar with these but ulta had these on sale and these are hard to find so i was surprised that even ulta even had these so i've been seeing these like all over tiktok um Anyways, so, so this is a sleep spray. It has melatonin and essential oils in it. They actually had, this is actually a huge bottle. So they had, if you buy two, they were $10, so basically $5 each. So I ended up buying three of each product. Do I make any sense? I don't know. All right, so let me give you a close up of this. So again, this is the Dr. Teal's sleep spray. So this is six floral ounce. I hear a lot of positive things. I hear that they actually help you to sleep without taking actual physical pills of melatonin. I guess you just spray it and it knocks you out. Let's just hope it does. All right, you guys, so I ended up buying three of these because as I mentioned, they were on sale. And if they really work, then I will use it for myself. You know, I wanna I wanna have a good night rest. You know what I mean? All right, guys, so the next item that I picked up is this perfume. Um, this is from Ariana Grande. This is R-E-M. Hopefully you're able to see the lighting. This is such a huge box, but it's really cute. I've never seen this in person before. So I do remember this was like $65. Now the only reason, two reasons why I end up picking this particular product out. This is where you are able to get like a bonus, bonus on top of a bonus, meaning that you're able to get a gift on top of another gift. So if you picked out this perfume right here, you then got a lunchbox, I guess one of a PR lunchbox that came with this um, perfume when it originally came out. And then on top of that, if you spent $65 or more on fragrances, then you were able to get 
something else for free. I don't remember vaguely what exactly what it was. So don't quote me, but I know you got some more things for free. So I'm like, okay, that's even a steal. You got the promotional PR box that you originally got when this came out. And then on top of that, you got additional items for free. So I'm like, it's bad, right? All right, you guys, so let's take a look. Whoa, okay. So, you know what this reminds me of? I'm not sure, well, that's actually really pretty in the camera. Um, this reminds me of like, um, Superman. I don't know why, but it did. Like, that's the first instant that clicked into head. Maybe it's because I see superhero and then bat, uh, Superman. Anyways, this is how my mind works. All right, you guys. Does this come out? Because it feels kind of loose. Hmm. Watch, I break it, right? Oh, no. It comes out. Okay. All right. So, the bottle by itself is still not bad, actually. So, let's go ahead and take this, this topper off and see what it smells like. Okay, so nothing yet, obviously, Carlos. Hmm. <sighs> it's good, but I'm gonna be completely honest, it smells like your typical celebrity fragrance with like kind of like that fruity vanilla scent to it. Nothing's wrong with those type of scents. But if you smell the celebrity scent, you pretty much smell them all. Let's just be completely honest. But again, as I really reason why I picked it up, because A, I already have another fragrance of hers, which is really nice. It actually really smells really nicely. My my words sound really tongue twisted right now. Anyways, it is the clouds. It comes like in the blue or no. I'm not sure what bottle, but it's the clouds. Anyways, actually now I'm smelling it more as a scent lingers. It has kind of like a, like almost like a masculine leftover lingering scent. Hmm, this actually isn't bad now. Think, now I'm smelling it a little bit more. I probably shouldn't have judged it so quickly. All right, you guys, so let's go ahead and put that aside. That actually is really pretty. All right, so the first item that I got here, uh, I did, is this the one I picked up? If, if this is the item that I pay for full price, I'm gonna be pissed off because it looks tiny. Ooh, yes. Dang, I was, ex okay, so I ended up spending, so this is from Clinique, and this is the All Shad All About Shadow 8 Pan, can't talk, 8 Pan something something. Anyway, so it's Wear Anywhere Pinks, um, but anyways, I ended up picking this up. This does retail for $44. It's pretty small, but the reason why I picked it up because you you also get free Clinique items too, and this was highly rated. Like one of like when I say highly rated, this particular palette for whatever reason I don't know, um, they had a lot of positive reviews. All right, so let's go ahead and just give you a close up. Hopefully you're able to see this. Do you see those shades right there? It's not translating well. Okay, maybe right here now. All right, those are actually really pretty. So there's a bunch of like grayish purples in there. Yeah, I am $44. It's kind of small, I'm not gonna lie. But if it does perform the way it, the reviews say, this is actually a perfect um, eyeshadow palette to take with you if you're traveling or a weekend getaway, especially if there's eight shades in here. And if it performs the way everyone's been hyping it about, then you know what? It's not a bad deal. All right, you guys. So the next item that I end up picking up, this is the new Jaclyn Cosmetics or Jaclyn Hill palette. This is from the Lux Legacy. This is a collaboration between her, meaning Jaclyn Hill, and her mom. So let's go ahead and take this out. So I believe, don't quote me, this palette retails for $45. No, I didn't get any extra goodies with this. It didn't come with any freebies. Oh, this is actually really pretty. So that is the front of the palette. Now she did release two um, different packagings for this particular palette. However, the palette, the shades in sight are exactly the same. Um, the limited edition one, you can only buy it directly on her website. So there's nothing on the back, just in case you're curious. Oh, wow, these are actually really nice. Um, why does that one look like it's breaking? Anyways, you guys, so these are the shades. At, this is actually really pretty. Like, it's pleasantly beautiful. Um, hmm, wait, no, that is loose. It is. I am so glad that I did not lift it up. Okay, I'm not sure if you're able to see this right here. This one, this pan right here, no, you're not able to actually a lot of these are loose. If you're able to see these, hmm, I bet you I can probably get this out. Like, this is how much of the, yep, look. Look at this, you guys. Look. 
<clears throat> I'm glad that I did not do this. I had a bad experience with ColourPop where I did that and all of a sudden one of the pans fell out of the actual palette. So now I'm always trying to be careful. All right, so I'm glad that I paid attention to that, but there looks like there's one, two, three, there's four, pa five pans in this palette right here that are not really securely in place. All right, you guys, so let me go ahead and put this down so I don't end up breaking it. But just in case you guys pick this up, as you saw, make sure that you actually hold it carefully because clearly there is an issue with quality performance. All right, no shade to Jaclyn Hill. It is what it is, it happens sometimes. All right, you guys, so the next item that I end up getting, so this was a free gift with purchase. So this was a Clinique item. So again, once I purchase the $44 uh, or the Clinique uh, product, whatever, then you got this bag of goodies, I believe. Now, no, I did. I'm gonna say I believe. So we got in here is the cosmetic bag, as you see. Then we got Clinique. This is take the day off makeup remover. So we got that right there. And then we got a Clinique Foamy Sonic Facial Soap. Hopefully you're able to see that. And then it looks like we got a lipstick here. So then we have a, this is Rare Up, I guess. I cannot, the font is so tiny, I can barely see it. Anyways, let's take a, ooh, this is actually a really beautiful shade. You guys see this? All right, I'm not gonna swatch this because I think I might end up giving this away as a Mother's Day gift. Hence the reason why it was like the most perfect time to actually get these items. All right, guys. So I ended up picking up three of these right here. Where's the other one? Where's the other one? I'm asking you like you know. All right, guys. So I ended up picking three of these hats. So as you can see, I have a tendency to wear a lot of hats like hats and beanies and things like that. But the reason why I ended up picking this particular style out, so there's a gray one here. Just in case if you wanna know, I'm sorry, I'm all rude, I didn't even show you too clearly. So this is from Grace El wait, Elia, Elia? I believe, I could be pronouncing this completely wrong. Anyway, so it's adjustable slap instead of, Anyways, do you guys? So pretty much it's like, it's almost like the style of a bonnet, but it's not a bonnet. But the nice thing about it, so oh, again, colors. Gray, black, and then this green one right here. Let's, let's try this black one right here. All right, you guys, so let's go ahead and just take it out. The nice thing about these is that it actually has like a satin lining. Is it satin? Uh, yeah, it's satin. It's a satin lining so that it doesn't damage your hair. And it actually has like an adjustable strap on here so that you can just put it on there and then you can go to bed with it. You can go out and about. Let's go ahead. Don't judge me on my hair. All right, you guys. So let's go ahead and see. Look at this. Oh my goodness, this is horrible. So this is the reason why, because I'm always wearing caps or something in that nature to keep my hair looking... I was about to say looking cute, but clearly he's not looking cute right now. Anyways, I'm um, keeping it safe. Ooh, I like how it just snugged onto my head. All right, you guys, so I gotta be real care careful because I got on some foundation, so I don't wanna get this dirty already. All right, you guys, look at this. Hmm, okay. Got some hairs that just don't wanna stay down. So let's take a look at the. Okay, I like this. I like this a lot. All right, so I believe I got these or paid $15 for them. They weren't on sale. You didn't get anything special. I just hooked I just hooked myself up because I needed some. Anyways, so yeah, you can wear these at night or you can wear them, you know, going out and about, about um, you know, on your day. Does that make any sense? Anyways, you guys, so the, remember I was telling you about the Dr. Steel Steel's products? Damn, these are huge. I didn't realize these were gonna be so big. So these are the lotions. So I ended up picking three of these lotions up. Yep, they're right here. So we got the three. So this is eight ounces here. I wonder how they smell. Hmm. There is no safety seal. Hmm. I'm not sure, like, the scent smells like lotion, like just straight up lotion. Does that make any sense where you get, I got no, I got no, I got no room. Um, you know when you get like a product and it actually smells like, like what it is? Yeah, it, it's okay, nothing bad. Anyways, you guys, so 
All right, so I ended up picking up this other like palette is Black Opal. Like it's a black owned business uh, company. So I ended up picking this, I think this was like $13, but I also saw a lot of positive reviews on this particular eyeshadow palette. So that's the reason why I ended up picking this particular one up. So just in case you want another close up right here. And then this is the back. All right, what else do we got? So, all right. So if you did purchase the Clinique items and you purchased over like 40 or 40 something dollars, you were able to then pick this up right here. It retails for, um, it retails for $170, but all you have to pay is $35. I think it says it right here. Yeah, actually right here. So if you purchase anything that was 46 bucks and then you're able to pick this, this like gift set right here, it comes like a, with a makeup bag. It came with a all about clean two in one cleanser and exfoliating jelly, um, anti-pollution. Then it came with a uh, moisture surge or whatever that is. It looks like it comes with a bronzer and mask mascara and then kind of like a lip crayon type of product like that anyways for like 35 bucks i didn't think that was actually a bad deal so that's the reason why i ended up picking this up because i thought this would be a great like mother's day gift so all right so i got that and then oh when you purchase over like a certain amount of like like fragrance remember i was telling you, you get like a second gift for free this is what it was so you got a choice between two different bags like like purses so you either got like a crossbody bag or you can get a tote so i ended up getting the tote because i saw pictures online of how the tote looks about how how the tote looks like and i was like oh that's not that bad i just couldn't find any pictures of how the crossbody purse looked like and i can give this away to somebody so it comes like this tassel over here i'm not going to take it out because again this is going to be our gift so this is an ulta product brand oh dang i just ripped the papers anyways you guys so that's how it looks like this actually is a pretty decent size so let's open this sucker up so it is a strap and that is the the inside it doesn't smell you know sometimes when you get like the fake plastic type of material that supposed to look like leather and it smells actually this doesn't so that is the inside the inside feels kind of like um I'm not sure the like a like a like that suede type of material. That's what it feels like inside. So it doesn't look like it would scratch anything that you may have that you're worried about, like sunglasses. But yeah, that's that. All right. So the last and oh no, I got two items in here. So uh, what is this? Oh, this this was an item that was for free. What is this? I'm just picking it up. So this is also from Clinique. I also got this for free. So um, I know I got two other items for free, but again, they're not coming. Well, I got three more items for free. I got like a lip pencil and then I got like this little bundle, like a beauty bundle um, for like, it was normally 15, but then it came for free. Anyways, guys, so this is what I picked up or this is what it was given to me. So this is even better clinical radical dark spot corrector. All right, this is actually like a decent pretty size. This doesn't seem like it would be a deluxe. Anyways, you guys, so the last and final product that we picked up. So remember when I said you got like that free um, lunch box or product like when purchasing um, the REM. So this is the original PR box. I wonder if it says it on here. Actually, it doesn't. It just says Ariana Grande fragrances box lunch. This sucker is huge. I didn't think it was, but it's super cute. All right, guys. So this is the box here, the lunch box. Look at this. Think I was in school. I will rock the hell. I will rock the heck out of this. Anyways, you guys, so yeah, this is super cute. Look at this. Okay, so there's nothing inside, but wow, you guys, this is, I was, ex you know, I'm not gonna lie. I was expecting this to be like a tiny little lunchbox. No, this is like hardcore true size lunchbox. And I love the fact that it's tin and not plastic because it gives like that old school nostalgia vibe, you know, back in days when lunchboxes were out of tins. Anyways, guys, so if you want to see a really like a close up, so this is um, lifted up 
so you get like that whole feeling so there's the side of it the side of it has the perfume bottle and then we got oh, what's the dog's name i can't remember anyways so that's the doggy and her this is actually really cute i love the whole ufo type of theme that's going on and then the handle right here is like this lavender pink this is actually super cute i am 100 percent happy that i did pick this up um so all together what i ended up spending was this is including like i have 53 dollars uh, of points that i was able to like redeem towards like my whole purchase that i ended up spending so all together if i remember correctly it was like 225 dollars which if you think about it, isn't that bad of a deal. With everything I just showed you, not bad. So this is the reason why I like to wait out going like doing like a huge overall Ulta haul because during the Christmas seasons, during Thanksgiving or during like Mother's Days and things like this, this is when you can get like the best deals. What I like to do is when I'm on their website, I always go to when they you, you change like you pick out the departments or what you're looking for like new new arrivals hair care i always go for the um gifts gifts with purchase and there it'll show you all the gifts with purchase and then it'll tell you you click on there and then it'll tell you which product you would actually have to purchase in order to get that item so that's pretty much what i do i kind of figure out like okay what's the price point that i'm comfortable with and if I'm able to pick that up, do I then, does it fall under another promo where I'm able to get multiple gift items, which in this case with the fragrances, I was able to get the lunchbox and um, that handbag and something else. And then with Clinique, I was able to pick up that deal, which then boost up my overall Clinique purchase to receive additional Clinique items for free. So this wasn't a bad deal overall, you guys. Anyways, you guys, yeah, as always, definitely leave a comment below because I love hearing you guys' thoughts and opinions about the products that I picked up. Anyways, you guys, if you haven't done so already, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Also hit the notification bell as well. So anytime I upload new videos, you automatically get the notifications and give my video a thumbs up as well because as always, I greatly appreciate it when you guys do. All right, you guys, until then, make sure you all brush your teeth, wash your culo, and subscribe. I will see you all in my next video. Take care. Bye now.